the more you learn, the more you see. So many of you will remember the warrior spam from a few uh, patches ago, a few hotfixes ago, where you could get lots of warrior IFVs by putting the machine gun teams in the warriors. Well, they removed the ability for the warrior to do that, uh, but you can still do exactly the same thing with every other division, or at least every other nation in the game. So the French get this AMX-10P, which is sort of like a poor man's warrior, it's losing one side armor essentially, and it's 20 mil instead of 30 mil. And you can just do exactly the same thing. Uh, so here's 21 AMX-10Ps, coming with the Escort APC, which are these 25 point squads for the FAMAS, and they get the IFV trait as well, which is absolutely hilarious. So you can keep them near the amx 10 for a few more buffs and you can do it with the medium machine gun, the French medium machine gun, uh, 25 points again in an AMX 10P for 35 points. So exactly the same thing you could do as first armoured but better and uh, naturally this is still in the game. So we're going to abuse this. So here we are against Sacris. Uh, we're on chemical which is not a great map to showcase what I'm on about because there's not a whole lot of open ground, but we can still spam a lot of infantry and IFVs. They'll die a lot, but that's how it goes. Uh, Sacris always dodges me. After the game, I'll show you how many... This guy also goes by Bakers. I'll show you how many games he has. He has, uh, he has about 2,000 games, and it's because if he comes up against anybody he knows, he just quits straight away. <laughs> He's actually quite a good player, but his rank is a lot lower than uh, you would you would expect for his skill because he dodges anybody uh, better than him. Which is one way to play, I suppose. I mean, the best way to improve is actually to lose as many of you. Uh, because failure is the greatest teacher. So naturally, I only upload games where I win uh, because I don't want to learn anything. So, we'll beat him in a protracted forest fight anyway, because our infantry is just sort of better. So let's uh, push our advantage a little bit there. And, um, yeah, just sort of push our advantage everywhere. He does get forward deployment, we don't. But that's not going to make one hell of a lot of difference. So yeah, the reason he's not dodging is because I'm called uh, something in French. Which I will not elaborate on further. And I've messed with my recording settings a little bit, so if I'm too loud, please let me know. I'm going to turn the game volume up a little bit. I starting and we've not placed any units, uh, this is not good. Commandos are very And of course we need some AA. On this map AA is a bit weird. Because of... One second please. Because of sight around buildings. That messes with AA, if you didn't know already, that's the reason. And so, yeah, we're going to be relying on uh, our fighters a little bit. Um, yeah, how fighters, got to be. And they fixed that bug with the fighters as well. There's not a whole lot else I can buy here. I think I, think I should get a group anti-char for the forest. That does not lead us with enough for us. We're only... AMXs. So he has a forward deployment CV. He only gets two of those. And that means he's missing a card of infantry, which is a big mistake on this map. But yeah, do not underestimate 
uh, Sacris. He is a very good player. What? I've only twice though because he always dodges me. So the typical way of playing French is that you spam these Vab T20s, but you see these only have one armor and they're fast, whereas these have three front armor, they cost five points more, and they're slow. On a map like this, is your speed going to help you? You have to consider that um, there's not really anywhere to go quickly, is there? I don't see anywhere. Weird that I haven't run into them yet, though. Gotta be wary around these uh, uh, areas. FV432s, so that's an interesting choice. Max Vet as well. Wonder what's in that. Let's kill it. He sees me. Ah, SS Patrol in an FV432. So, I don't recommend that, basically. <laughs> The advantage of the SAS Patrol is that they're fast at the start and they come with ground surveillance radar. Which you don't really get if you're... Um... Sorry, I'm a bit lethargic today. You don't really get that advantage if you're so slowly. 432, not, not an amazing piece of kit really, it's got one armour. It's amphibious, which is helpful. But guess what? So is this. Oh, no, it's not. Never mind. <laughs> ah, okay. So I get some anti-tank guys up here, and now we know where his push is. I did want to send one of these around here, but I guess I messed it up. Escorte PC obviously don't get an anti-tank option. Check this out. So a big armoured push in the middle. I mean, playing tank divisions on this map's a bit of a pain in the neck. You are so dead, my friend. Yeah, wasn't fast enough. Infantry is a lot slower than it used to be, I believe. And there goes that rapier. The Escarto PC can tank for quite a long time. They have, since the hotfix, increased the damage done by... Um, people against infantry. Damage done against infantry in general. SAS patrol of course equipped with the law and satchels so they're not going to have a fun time against this AMX-10 which can survive a hit. That was a hit and a miss. Uh oh. Ah, that wasn't particularly intelligent. So he's, he's now missed twice, but he was pretty stressed. There's his leader, and uh, I think it's going quite well. Just getting a guy up here, and those, those tanks that he's got, you know, they're not very useful where they are. Ah, okay, so now he's moving them. And I think we're going to get this, but bomb bombers are a bit weird right now. Okay, because yeah, they buffed them back up a little bit. So there you go, we got him. And I'm not really sure where his points are going. Thanks for that. France a bit better than the UK in these trash fights. My infantry is just way cheaper than his right now. I do pray for buffs, but 
Whatever I play gets nerfed, so that's why we're playing France today, ladies and gentlemen. And as you can see, our Warriors, uh, I mean, uh, <laughs> our AMX 10s are really, really just everywhere. Pretty pervasive. Uh, because we can bring them with such cheap units, we just have the ability to sponge for days. That's exciting. I assume that's a CV. Nope, it's a tank. Uh, HE Bomber's not so good against tanks anymore. That's going to be a problem, depending on depending on what sort of angles we get. Yeah, that's not going to be a problem. As you can see, Bomber's nerfed a bit. Do you wonder where he's going? Oh, he's going for the Gazelle. He smoked in time, which was very smart of him. Our CV is almost through. Ah, but we are losing grounds here. Thankfully, plus three for the moment. Advantage. A good once they get into a building. What more is there to say? It's an interesting patch. Heavy heavy tanks seem to be quite strong right now. Or at least stronger. And we'll, we'll see how that develops. I mean, it's far too early to be saying one way or another, conclusively. I was happy that artillery was buffed up a little bit. I mean, it was basically useless before. And now we see where all his points are. So, more than happy to just fall back on that. An artillery piece. Always worth checking the distance before you shoot. Is he coming towards me? <laughs> no, he's not. Ah, fantastic. Don't shoot. Free stuff, don't shoot. That is within 850. Nice. Lots of free stuff for me here. Gonna drop the bomber on these guys, and uh, yeah, we we do have a serious problem over here. So we will probably lose this this sector. But I mean, at some point, he's not going to be able to bring in units anymore, which is slightly more of a problem. As you can see, somebody tried to bomb me here. Redcoats in an open field, and you only kill like four of them, so. It, yeah, it is uh, a bit worse than it used to be. Hopefully he flies over this. And we have now capped his back point. So there's the helicopter looking for it. And yeah, don't worry, we'll just shoot that. Ah, our supply is not having a good time though. And we can always just move, you know. It's kind of weird that we lost visual there, though. Ah, I'm being very, very silly. Like, is it? Just keep driving people into their deaths, it's really stupid. And I lost all my guys here to these three men in this building. Which was my own fault. Yeah, if you're careful, you know, you can get things up a bit better uh, by exploiting sightlines, etc. Do you need to 
evac this man, I just want him to evac over the grey zone. And we just shot his command tank in the back, so that's dead now. Another Harrier, but I have lots of AA here. Sadly the Mirage had to evac. Yes, the command knows though. See, our bombers feel a bit temperamental actually, because I bombed a guy in the open, he didn't die, but... That was a bomb on a forest. Just gonna have to keep threading the needle here to shoot down these gazelles, but we're now plus five. What's this? Oops. So just thread the needle. I think there's a rape around here, but we'll be okay. Because obviously the AA is here, right? And then we just curve around, and yeah, we're not gonna get the, the angle on that. Uh, losing this was a problem, and it didn't have to be this way, really. It's very silly of me. And these, these things run out of fuel quite fast, it seems. Yeah. Ah, okay, so that's going to be a problem. Oh, that didn't one shot it in its side armor. That's oh three side armor. Okay. And he's got no recon, so I'm pretty sure he's not going to see this either. I'm going to shoot that tank in the side. Command zone lost, so he's back in over here. Uh, we finally see these people. We got a bomber. Looks like he's extended past his AA, so that's going to be good for us. And that's just a gazelle recon, so we'll be okay. Although there's somebody in over here, right? So we're gonna move over here now. And that one got them, and the last one didn't. So I, it's gonna take me a while to figure out what's going on with these bombers. There's the tank. So yeah, we're just gonna keep spamming. Just keep spamming our not warriors. Do some minstrels actually. Oh dear. Just gonna thread the needle again, get that other hell on. He's blowing up his own supplies, so it doesn't bother me too. Oh, I don't think we're going to turn in time. Turn circle on these guys is a bit weird. No, we got him. And there's no AA over here, so we're going to eat back over here. I see him. He's getting there. Remember to be on fast move and not attack move? Oh dear. Now he's turning in the middle of the road. Oh, yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, nope. Okay. And now he's now he's stopped to turn again, and now he's dead. <laughs> so that was a fast move uh, in all but name. <laughs> There's that tank again. He is now plus one, so we need to get the lead out a little bit and stop. Remember when I bought this for all that money? Didn't use it.
So the AMXs do lose to the Warriors just because his auto cannon's a bit better than mine, but you know, you're paying more for that, so it's not MP. There's no real reason to stay here. We're not going to be able to hold it, so. Just got to fall back a little bit. And uh, start spamming again, stop pissing about. Oh dear, this keeps happening. It's weird though, not, not even shooting back. Oh, I see, because of the range of the 30mm over the 20mm. I know they don't get any seed capable stuff, don't worry about it. And yeah, you know, you can't. That doesn't work anymore, clearly. Uh, <laughs> Oh, oh, I messed that up. I messed that up a lot, actually. You are so dead, my friend. Okay. Let's get a TV in here. I don't see anybody here. Apart from that, that warrior will still be up here. Which is a bit annoying, but that's life, isn't it? Yeah, if we could keep visual on that, that's going to be really interesting. Whoa. And we got the tank. You only get two of those in the card. I believe I've killed them both now. Bit of a problem over here. <laughs> We have spammed too much, we have memed too much, and now this game is taking a lot longer than it ought to. And we're actually starting to run out of things just because I was spamming too much. I'm sort of, you know, playing like a dummy because I thought it was funny. Great to use minstrels behind the lines to just do things like that. I mean, he is dead. There's nothing I can do for him. These AMXs, these AMX 13s, everything's called AM. The AMX 13 AA runs out of um, fuel quite quickly, it seems. And I so you gotta start building tanks, buying tanks. And at this point, I think he is out of CVs. Let's see what happens when this rolls up. Oops, you've just run into satchel range, you buffoon. Ah, okay, so he does have a CV left. And you know, the, the bombers don't kill light skinned things anymore. Don't kill much of anything these days. So that's just something I have to adapt to. It's going to take me a very long time to figure out what's what. Who's who? 
Yeah, the Apples obviously eats these people for breakfast, lunch and dinner. In a cruel twist of fate, I'm actually running out of stuff to fears. Ah, so that's me gone. No. <laughs> yeah, it's only that time, really. And there he is. Really do have to stop. How many of these guys he has left? I could still bring in some flams, I suppose. Let's move this up might as well. That's the CV. Oh, it's, it's in the water, that's why it's so slow. Oh, they're shooting the chieftain. If I lose the CV tank, I'm going to be pretty upset. He's running over there now, and that tank will stop me. Yeah, the tank will stop me from getting in there. Getting in on that. I've lost that. Oh, never mind. Saved by the smoke that I deployed earlier. Blimey, he has a lot of inf. I thought he was going to run out. This is going to have to come out. I haven't seen much AA lately. But yeah, the bombers are a bit temperamental these days, if I feel. So who knows if I got anybody there. You get six of these, I feel like I've killed about four. What are you? That is that is his command tank that he's trying to use to get the zone. That's why he's driving it in such a weird place. See if we can get that. And yeah, I need to spend my points quick person about. These blobs are pretty funny, man. On revient toujours au fantassin et son fusil. So yeah, gun runs still do something. Oh dear. Right, that's a problem. Yeah, so that's that tank that I told you about. He's plus five now, because this guy's still healing. He eventually died. I do wish he'd run out of... Uh, inf but... I've played extremely badly, and now we are in this situation. He's still not run out of... Oh, my 
He's one vet, so if we get a gun run off on him, which we won't. And oh yeah, I don't have a CV in here because I, I'm running out of CVs now. Okay, that's bad. E to D should have played a lot better, really. It's a bit big mistake to uh, underestimate my opponent here. stumbled across his CV. I don't see where else he could possibly be at this point. Ah, there it is. But I can't kill it. And yeah, my tank's still moving. Um, this better be dead by the time it gets here, so I can get straight back. And um, yeah, we just can't kill it because we ran out of infantry along. We've got one group anti-char left. Blimey. Where the fuck did he go? Where the fuck did he go? Ah, uh, it's a shame because if I haven't killed him, he's gonna come back. <laughs> Is, um, when my guy gets back in, but yeah, I really, really fucked this up, dude. I could have won pretty easily. Like, what just happened to all my air? That was really dumb of me. Again. And yeah, I think we got him uh, here, but he didn't die once again, so he'll bring it back. And he's still plus three. If this gets sniped going down this road, then it's GG basically, because we're out of things. And yeah, we never really used most of our tools to play from me just throughout all the time. <laughs> It's, we didn't do combined arms warfare. I was just sort of pissing about, really, and uh, now I'm paying the price for that. Mirages are a bit. Lethargic, I would say. Ah, there's one. You saw him, right? Um, yeah, bit of a funny game.
I have so many guys and I shoot them and they, you know. Really not sure what's going on with this. Oh, I see, it's because of the air optics. Oh man, and he's still up. He might get me now as well. I have so many fighters. I guess I should buy some A. <laughs> so there goes my bomber, which is going to be a big problem. So he's still got all of his. And we just got his CV. And he surrenders. So yeah, that was a really funny game. And, uh, you know, he, like I said, he's got 2,054 games with NATO and 235 as packed because he just surrenders whenever he comes up against anybody with a high rank. But he's not actually a bad player, he just enjoys noob stomping.